Good Sunday morning to you. It is November the 26th, 2017. Hey Google, good morning. Good morning, Rusty. It is 7.25 a.m. <clears throat> right now in Burnett it's 48 and sunny. Today, it'll be sunny with a forecasted high of 77 and a low of 48. Have a wonderful day. Thank you. Beautiful day. Hey Google, tell us a joke. Okay, here you go. What's the best part about living in Switzerland? I don't know, but the flag is a big plus. It is a big plus. Actually, it is. It, it very much is. But anyway, it is Sunday morning. It's cool here in Central Texas. Not cold, but cool. Comfortable, nice. Uh, I had someone look at the RV yesterday. Who knows? I mean, they want to tow it and they want to hook it up and do all kinds of stuff. We'll see about all that. I told them to make me an offer first and then we'll go from there. <clears throat> but anyway we got a lot of comments a lot of comments and here's MMP Cody on comment call and he says if I had the truck to pull it I would make a trip to Kingsland Texas and buy it at this moment but he doesn't have a truck so see there's always a little if you know except for that one thing <clears throat> but anyway thank you kind thought uh, he also says Walmart gave the option for pickup in store for Black Friday stuff so I ordered it on Friday and went today to pick it up so much easier than dealing with all those crowds. Yeah, he says he was in and out in 10 minutes. <clears throat> this is Rondlin 100. She says, okay, which one of you Rangers wants to head up the parter party when Rusty hits 10,000? David, I'm going through my closet right now for the perfect outfit. Well, let me tell you, you might be a lot older than you think because <laughs> the number of subscribers has slowed down considerably. <clears throat> but that's all right. I'm still doing them. Thank you, though, Rondolin. <clears throat> Avlisk, he says, hey, Rusty, here's some solar items you or your rangers might be interested in. He's got a link to a YouTube video about solar stuff, apparently. It's Avlisk on comment call, and here's David on comment call. It says, remember this, partner? Those Amazon link reminders are as important for your regulars as they are for your newbies. <clears throat> It's easy to slip. I did once last week and kicked myself a day late and a dollar short, which happens to be about 1% of my purchase. I use your link often, but always have to think before I shop. I know it's, you know, it's not something that should be part of your routine, but I thank you for remembering me. But anyway, for those of you that are new or not new, <coughs> I am an Amazon affiliate and I get a small commission if you use the link to Amazon products in the description of my videos it's in every description there's a link to Amazon products click on it go to Amazon and whatever you buy during that shopping session I get a small commission yeah so yeah I'll try to remind you but th there was a few people that used it yesterday and uh, it's working out okay it's it's really filling the gap uh, in the YouTube hole because <clears throat> YouTube demonetizes at least well, there's a constantly six video, approximately six videos demonetized, or uh, what do they call it? Uh, not suitable for all advertisers, and uh, and it just rolls forward, and, and then you know every day they monetize some and demonetize more. But I'm not complaining. I, it's still a source of revenue, and uh, I, it, it's working out okay. That's that's that. Clint on comment call have Rogers Motors broker the sale they are an rv dealer they can hold the trailer no that's i'm not worried about it guys you know when these if, if somebody gets ready to buy it well, i'll work it out you know i'm not to, i'm not totally in the dark here this ain't my first rodeo so to speak i did that video because i felt like it would be a good mental exercise for everyone to you know to, to, to voice their thoughts <clears throat> and get a little feedback and kind of you know polish their diamond so to speak it, the whole thing was just to keep people from getting cheated when they buy and sell products. That's all. A mega value customer. That's the guy's name. <clears throat> this is on the RV propane tank. Uh, I know YouTube is giving you grief with your videos. I have included a link to a video that claims to know how to out outsmart YouTube's demonetization software. I don't know if it works or even if it's worth the effort. Thank you. That's very good. I, I'm not going to try to outsmart them. I mean, I, I'm fine. You know, I, I'm, it's working. I'm not, and you know, if it ain't broke, don't fix it, okay? And so we're moving right along here. Clint says this is on propane. 
My brother multiple times ran out of propane during a cookout. He'd go to a neighbor, borrow their tank to finish, and then refill both. You having the extra tank will be your margin of comfort. Please find a way to securely strap it in place in the White House when traveling. Uh, what I'm going to do is uh, just get a cardboard box and put it inside the cardboard box, and it'll be fine. <clears throat> uh, I bought, let's see, this is uh, Old Lady Fish on Comment Call. I bought and sold several cars via PayPal on eBay. Okay, so there you go. Uh, this is Propane Tank. Sarah, hi, hey Rusty. Happy Thanksgiving weekend from one of the Rangers. Great info. I am so happy you are going to be cool on your journeys. I think he cool is so very important, or being cool, more than the heat most days for you and your cooking and more water needs. Yeah, no, I'm, I'm good. I mean, it, the, the, this, this RV is fine for me. You know, if... Uh, I planned to, you know, do some traveling starting in March. You know, believe it or not, guys, it's already a few days from December. December, January, February, and psh, here we go. <clears throat> traveling with Rick on the propane tank. All propane tanks are filled 80% capacity to allow for expansion. Uh, it feels light when lift or lift it, get filled or replaced. That's my, yeah, just, I, I'm not going to, it's not a big deal with me. I mean, if they fill it 80%, that's fine. I just live with it. Uh, HVAC Mike, <clears throat> he's got two, one on the Lear 180 and one on the improved fan cooling. Uh, on, this is on the Lear 180 pickup camper that I camped in for a while, as y'all may recall. Love the video. If you don't have a soft open feature on your tailgate, you can buy one online for less than $30. Then pop the latch and let go, and the tailgate will open slowly. Mine is a ZD brand, 45 minutes to install. Okay, thank you. Uh, this is HVAC Mike again on the fan. Air, like other things, take path of least resistance. It will cool better if you close in the sides and increase the wet area to allow the fan to breathe. Might use a few more watts of power, though. Okay, thank you. Good point. <clears throat> May use that when I'm camping in this thing. Talaka 47 comment call. Can USAA set up an escrow account? I'm sure they could. Yeah, you know, there's a jillion ways to do it, guys. And you know, all your input is helpful. But let me say this: if if I can find a willing buyer, in other words, somebody makes me a bona fide offer, then I can go to step two. Right now, I hadn't even got step one. Okay. So Dennis M, a propane tank, a milk crate works. Yeah, there you go. Uh, works uh, for fine for stowing. An extra propane tank. Yeah, that's all you need. Just something to set it in. <clears throat> Water filter. Uh, Nick as usual. That's the guy's name. Nick as usual. Thanks for the review, Rusty. Yeah, I got me uh, uh, the one I've got now. Hell, I can't even remember the name of it, but it's one of those pitcher filters. It works okay. Comment called David Edelman. Rusty, I forgot to mention something that I did one time purchasing a camper. The title was not readily available so we made two copies of a bill of sale one of the one the bill of sale was a copy of both driver's license phone numbers and we had the signatures notarized <coughs> I had a witness sign both copies and witnessed the transact transaction money and property were exchanged and I received the title at a later time uh, you know, there's again. That's a good idea Dave and I appreciate it but there's you know there's no, that, that that'll probably work there's no foolproof method okay uh anyway we got uh this is on my ram i did a video of my 2017 ram I, this was on the inside and this is seller rim s-e-l-e-r-i-m i like the new ram truck but that knob to change gears throws me off it threw me off too it took a while to get used to that little knob but yeah once you get used to it it's fine this is a long comment so i'm just going to read part of it and uh this is on the quartzite deal when i was out there last year <clears throat> says, hi, Rusty78609. I just found your channel and enjoying your coverage of the RTR rubber tramp. He calls it rodeo. It's actually rendezvous. Uh, where the introverts ride their lawn chairs until they fall off. Uh, you know, th they're all good people, guys. You know, I mean, you know, we're all good people. You know, just, uh, you know, uh, it is what it is. You know, he talks about not... He says, I don't crap in a bucket or shower with baby wipes. You know, and, and that's your choice. You know, these people are enjoying their life the best way they can. And it's affordable way of life for a lot of people. 
and uh, you know if you if you choose to live that that's your choice you know just remember that people people choose different lifestyles for different reasons and it's not up to me or anyone else to judge anyone else's decision period you know I mean a lot of people ju are judgmental of me but I just let it go off of me like water on a waxed car hood it just rolls off because I know they're they're trying to be nice and uh, you know but anyway I understand what you're saying it, it's just different and it's a shock to some people to see you know people living in in uh, vans and you know cars and other things and you know no facilities whatsoever just living like we lived a thousand years ago I, I personally think it's great uh, comment call Ernesto says notary or trusted second partner under 50k it's too expensive letter of credit so many possibilities even without paying tax your private banker Ernesto T he's my private banker now hello Ernesto well it will send me some a loan <clears throat> No, he says he says he won't. He says I don't need or will exceed. He's not going to accept any more clients. He covered that base. <laughs> Smart. Uh, selling anything. Uh, Sophia Anatolios. El Anatolios. Hmm. I have an idea. There should be a new invention, a bank just for where both parties go, and the bank switches the title, and the money. So there. So when everyone walks out, it's a done deal. Uh, they might even sell car insurance. Yeah, you know, the, uh, it, it's just a matter of time till it'll be that way. Okay, it, right now we're still shuffling paper, but I would say in five years that's going to be out. <clears throat> it'll it'll change. Here's Ernesto again, the banker. Simple. Follow the buyer. Four people in two trucks. The call the the, the don't cost you info where they live and and more is all. Next, you call the other six guys if they don't pay. <laughs> all right, here you go. Yeah, it'll all work out. This is on the 2018 Travel Light, Sherry Sprankle. Wow, you got lots of views on this one. Yeah, I did. I don't know what was so special about the 2018 Travel Light, that video I did, but apparently it, it did quite, it did well. Uh, I think you picked the right one for you with a bed and full bath. This one is nice, though, for camping. Yeah, <clears throat> you know, there's a lot of small campers, a lot of options for people. In fact, on, tomorrow I'll go back over to Burnett, Texas, to that RV dealership that uh, handles the small RVs and see if they've got anything new in because uh, uh, they said they were going to get in a new line of products, and I'll go over there tomorrow and see. I would go today, but they're not open on Sunday, and I don't want to just walk around the outside. I want to do a video on the inside. But anyway, for all you guys that are looking at RVs and, and wanting to go camping, you know, I've been talking to people periodically interested in, that are interested in buying my old or my pre-owned 2013 Jayco J-Flight 26BH. And, uh, you know, and there, uh, several of them are new to RVing, don't know anything. And, uh, you know, I, I, when I'm, I'm talking to them, it reminds me of when I started how really ignorant I was of the whole ordeal of camping in an RV or anything else. <clears throat> you know, as far as, you know, the hookups and, and the fresh water tank, the 12 volt pump, you know, I mean, I, I didn't know, and the awning and all this, you know, that's all new jargon to me. I really wasn't uh, up to speed on it, so to speak, had no one to ask. I learned the hard way, but anyway, uh, there's a lot of options out there and, uh, so we're going to go check some more out. And then uh, as far as me going camping, <clears throat> uh, any time, well, the weather is perfect here. For the next 10 days, you know, 70s and 50s, I mean, my God, perfectly clear skies, no bad, bad weather at all. You know, this is where you want to be. You know, Quartzsite has similar weather, but I still think we have as good or better weather right here in Central Texas, even in January and February. <clears throat> But anyway, uh, we'll go camping in March, probably, more than likely. In fact, I'd almost bet on it. And uh, what else? Uh, again, thank you guys that use the Amazon link. <clears throat> and the reason I remind you about the Amazon link is not to bore you with my ads uh, about it. It's just that uh, YouTube is really cutting my, well, not they're doing it to everybody okay and the reason they're doing it is a good reason a valid reason they're in business to make money okay and they make money 
from advertisers, all right? And uh, if advertisers are saying, look, we're not going to advertise on your channel unless y'all clean up some of these radical weirdo dudes, uh, then uh, then they go out and do it. because and, and, and they should do it, really, because, you know, you've got kids uh, six, eight, nine years old watching this stuff. And, you know, of course, you know, if they've got a, a, a laptop or a tablet or anything, they can go to any video on YouTube, any of them. And uh, naturally, like kids will do, they're going to be attracted to the really strange stuff. And, you know, it gets in their head, you know, stand guard at the door of your mind. But anyway, guys, from Central Texas, USA, on a beautiful day, you know, right now on my patio, it shows to be about 44. <clears throat> And uh, I'm going to go take my walk here in just a minute, and then I'll, hopefully this guy will call back on the RV. And they want to tow it. You know, they want to tow it with their vehicle and see how it, quote, tows. And I tell them, that's fine. You know, they hook it up. They tow it. I go along with them. That's fine. We'll ride up down the highway and, and then put it right back. Uh, but I told them, before we do that, uh, they're going to have to make an offer. Okay, in other words, we're going to have to shake hands. And he's going to say, okay, I'll offer you this much, and I'll have to accept it before we go do the drive. That's one. And then if uh, I told them also if they wanted to, because I'm an honest guy, I'm not trying to screw them. I said, you know, if you know somebody in Kingsland or know a place where we can, you know, hook it up to electric, uh, then I'll let you check out the air conditioner, the furnace, the direct ignition, propane tank, you know, and all the stuff uh, before we go. And I just noticed that my napkin that I had covering my breakfast had slipped into the bowl and soaked up all the water out of my stuff it's a mess okay so but anyway we're going to do that today hopefully they may never call back i don't know uh but we'll see eventually it will sell i think i hope i hope because you know i'm not going anywhere obviously till it sells and uh, <clears throat> what else can i tell you guys i can tell you oh hey google tell us a joke this might make you laugh the hokey pokey can be tough the first time you try it but eventually you turn yourself around that's the way it goes. You do the hope and turn yourself around. I don't know how the words go, but anyway, that's that's it. But anyway, guys, uh, what else? Uh, hey Google, what's the temperature in New York City? The temperature in New York City right now is 47. Same as here, guys. Same, same. We could be twins. Anyway, from Central Texas, USA. Thumbs up. Carpe diem. Adios. Bye bye. Buy USA. Made when you can, if you want to. It's your money. You can do whatever you want to with it. I've added that because it's true. Uh, what else? <clears throat> uh, drink plenty of water. Three or four quarts a day will not hurt you. It's good for you. It'll help you avoid gout, kidney stones, and help you lose weight because you'll be full of water. You won't want to eat so much. Next thing, take deep breaths. You know, breathe in deeply, oh, deep through your nose. You'll take it way down, hold it for a few seconds, and then breathe out slowly through your mouth. Why? What does that do? It lowers your blood pressure. And lowering your blood pressure does what? Uh, Oh, excuse me, it, it, no, that relieves stress and, that, and that, that lowers your blood pressure, which is good for you. I got that wrong, but that's the way it works. And then uh, stretch, stretch your arms, swing your arms, do all that stuff. You know, keep your health, uh, you know, because you know, I'm 72 years old and, you know, believe me, I'm aware of my health. And I know things are changing for me. I mean, I know, you know, all of a sudden I've got every skin issue that you can have and there's not a thing that can be done about it. The only thing they can give you is... Uh, symptomatic relief and that symptomatic relief sometimes will, it causes you some more problems so <clears throat> anyway it's it's okay I mean it, you know it, I'm fine so but having said that uh, here when it warms up after I finish my breakfast I'm leisurely breakfast I'm in no hurry uh, then uh, go do my walking and I'll do another video today on something I'll probably do a driving video I'll drive into uh, Kingsland Wow, we've never done that before, have we? Anyway, enjoy your day, guys. Adios.